Okay, so let's consider this um, raffle. Um, let's say there's 10 people in the raffle draw. Uh, there's three prizes. And let's say there's two situations. Uh, one where there's, there's three prizes in order. There's a first prize, a second prize, and a third prize. Let's also suppose that there's, it's just like a, a normal meat, tr meat raffle at the pub, very quiet pub, um, where you'll get the same prize if your number comes up. All right, so order matters in the first case, order does not matter in the second case. So if A, there's 10 ways to choose the first prize, then there's nine ways to choose the second prize, there's eight ways to choose the third prize. All right, that's the order matters, um, non-replacement um, type thing. Okay, so this gives us uh, an expression, which is the number, but it's not a particularly useful number, but we note that this is uh, 10 times nine times eight, Right, we obviously know that this is, uh, we can rewrite this thing in two factorial, as, as two different factorials. This is uh, 10 factorial divided by 10 factorial minus three, fact, uh, 10 minus three uh, factorial. So um, this gives us the idea of permutations. Uh, this thing's called permutation, um, where it's, it's 10 divided by 10, um, it's n, um, divide n factorial over n minus k factorial. Right, that's that's how we might uh, express this in a formula for the number of permutations. All right, so suppose that order doesn't matter. We don't care uh, which order these three come out in. That means that there's a number of different ways that we can arrange this, right? So we might, um, if we labeled all of our 10 participants, um, a, B, C, D, E, et cetera. Um, we can see that A, B, C is the same as C, B, A, um, and so on, right? So there's uh, three factorial ways to arrange three things. So there's three factorial ways of arranging these different um, uh, combinations. So three factorial times the combination, we'll, we'll call this a combination, it's 10, uh, three. Uh, and that's equal to the number of permutations, which we've determined is equal to 10 factorial on 10 minus three factorial. So the number of combinations, so 10 choose three, if you like, is uh, 10 over three factorial. Okay, so we can remember the formula um, that P N K is N factorial on N minus K factorial and uh, choose or the combination, this is sometimes read as N choose K, um, that's N factorial on K factorial N minus K all factorial. All right.